the all in all but even here like jesus said to the disciples when they asked him we have left everything our father more than everything we have what shall be our reward my joy in that scripture jesus did never said to them that they will have their reward in heaven alone he said here on earth you have your reward so god has a plan a reward for you here on earth you must accept that say god has a great plan amazing things for my future but the problem is this as powerful as god is as almighty he is god is limited by your capacity to receive the level of your capacity place a limitation of god and god will not go beyond that the problem has never been with god the problem has never been with the supply the problem has never been with our source which is god the problem is we not having the capacity to receive what god want to give to us praise the lord a lot of time people believe they are reached their limit the economy is bad nobody's buying a house i can buy a house nobody's married i can marry no things are hard okay the doctor has certified i'm sick they say this is what's wrong with my lungs or my chest so i have to live with it if you have reached your limit for any reason the doctor say you have to live like this for the rest of your life you know you have to mandate the growth mandate the cancer mandate the economy for the rest of your life that is how it's going to be so don't worry just manage you might probably live more years in life but just manage if you have reached your limit for any reason though god has the ability and the resources to help you you will not have what you want because you place a limit on the potency of god to do what you want to do what he has promised to do if you as a child of god you believe you have reached your limit of growth your limit of expansion your limit of resources your limit of health i can't live heavier than this i must by way where i just have to manage if you place a if you have reached your limit for any reason though god has the ability and the resources to help you you will not get anything from god your limitation place a limitation on god's ability oh glory to god you have to enlarge your vision you have to enlarge your dream you have to make room for the new thing that god want to do in your life i will not place a limit on the potency of god's promise you have to enlarge your vision and make room for the new thing that god want to do about to do in your life isaiah chapter 43 verse 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 19 says behold i will do a new thing somebody say a new thing say behold i will do a new thing this is god talking no matter what you have seen before no matter what you have experienced before he said behold i will do a new thing and it shall spring forth say shall you not know it oh glory to god hallelujah shall you not know it say i will even make a way in the wilderness and rivers in the desert no matter what is going on your attitude should be i know the economy may be down i know this may not be working but i know my god is on the throne i know the job i took have not worked out the way I, I wanted it to work but i know the healer is on the throne i know men have turned their back on me but i still believe god is on the throne i know there is there was nothing in my house and in my hand but i know god is on the throne if you have this attitude you are telling god i know you can go beyond my expectation amen your attitude should be yes i know that things are, are so bad are so tough your attitude 
should be no matter what is going on with me and in me i know my god is on the truth this is the secret that enabled joe to prevail over the circumstances that before him the wife asked him to cause God. The friends accused him of being the worst sinner. Everybody had turned their back against the man, the weirdest man from the east. But Job said, Until the day of my appointed time, I will wait until my change come. And he said, I know my Redeemer liveth. And yet my body has been afflicted. My children have been taken away away from me my farm have got bought my farm everything i owe I, I i i labor for over the years have been taken away i still know my redeemer i know he lives see your faith increases god's ability your faith exposes god's ability see uh, until your faith is enhanced you may never can tell what God will do next when things are not going well your statement and your utterance should be his favor surround me like a shield ah goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life 